hello and welcome to Science with the Doyles part 2. Alright, so we've got Steffi Doyle, our usual assistant, and our new assistant, Jack Doyle. Say hello Jack. Hello. And myself, Nicky Doyle. Uh, like last time, we have our safety goggles, because what we're going to do is repeat the last experiment with a few extras this time, just to make it a bit more interesting. So again, we've got our white wine vinegar. Oh, uh, let's see, a bicarbonate of soda. Hello, Jack, Seth. Uh, we've got our green food colouring. Yes, we like the green food colouring. Yeah, good. Uh, Seth's favourite colour, actually. What have we got, Seth? A pink, pink. measuring jug. Right. And then, uh, extra again this time. We have a red wine. We have an empty bottle. Uh, what else have we got, Seth? A, a glow blue. A glow blue. Alright. So, first of all, we're going to pour in, let's see, we'll have to divide this so we both boys get good assistance in this experiment. Do you want to put on your safety goggles, Seth? Yeah. Right, Jack. You take this white wine vinegar, please, and pour it into our measuring jug. Up to about here. That should be about half. I want you to spill it in two. Yeah, you will. Go on, Jack. Go for it. You don't have to be too careful. It's not a dangerous experiment. <laughs> Keep going. Keep going. Let me have Yeah, in a minute. Keep going, Jack. Keep going. Let me have a go. Right, that'll do you. Right, just a minute, Seth. Come on, have a bit, a bit of patience. Jack is now going to pour his vinegar into... Our empty Pepsi bottle. Other brands are available. How do you do it? Right, Jack, come on. You will get a go, Seth. Just Jack's gonna do his go first. That's it. Keep it going. Get it all in there. That's it, well done. Hardly even a drop spilt. The face of concentration. Look, he's a geek. He's got his geek top on. Keeps the goblin. Yeah, don't worry about spilling a little bit. That's all right. Right, and uh, well done to our assistant. And Seth, if you want to pour that into your pink measuring jug now. That's it, good boy. Well done. <laughs> yes, uh, Seth got that in a little bit more rapid. Well done, I'll take your measuring jug. Um, pour it into your bottle, best you can. Good boy, another face of concentration. Well done, that's good pouring. What an assistance. Oh, a little bit of a spill there. We won't worry about that though. Keeps it going. All the way. That's it. Well done. A little bit more. Good. And all over Daddy's hand. I'm going to stink of vinegar now all night. Mummy won't come anywhere near me. Again. Right then. So, let's get our a green food colouring. Seth likes to get a few extra drops in, if you remember from last time. Right, who's going first with the green me, food colouring? Me, me. Okay, take your green food colouring, Seth. And get a few drops in there. Don't forget to squeeze. That's it. Good squeeze. Keep squeezing. Right, and that'll do you. Okay, and um, Jack have a go. Jack, our new assistant, joining in quite nicely there. Giving a good squeeze. Brutal. Lovely jubbly, and that's your dinners. Alright, you put that back, Jack, put the top on. And again, you will see our vinegar has gone green. We didn't use the vinegar last time to put on our chips. You know, it wasn't quite nice after the bicarbonate soda went in it. Right, so now we'll give it a quick shake. Jack, you can give it a shake. And me. Well done, oh yes, and, and assistant number two, or one, whatever you want to be. Give it a shake. Well done. So now we have our green vinegar. Mm. Let's take that top back off. Put it to the side. Now, what we need now is, is our balloon, our glow balloon. Right then, so we're going to pull the lid off of that, Seth. Well done. That's glow. It's glowing a little. 
And we've got our bicarbonate of soda. Right, have we got our little measuring? No, we haven't got a funnel, so we're just going to have to try and pour it in the best we can. Right, so Jack, if you hold the phone and point it towards the balloon, the balloon. You look at the screen. Seth, go on, you can do it. And no, not Seth, get it in the balloon. That's it. You get it in the balloon. Well done. Well, yeah, we'll say well done. Right, and Daddy will hold this again. Great filming there, Jack. And uh, you get your bicarbonate of soda. And this time, Seth, where you going? Ah, don't worry about cleaning up, that's Mummy's job. We're, we're the scientists. Right? That'll be right. our right. You hold the camera now. Keep a pointer at Jack, like that. That's it, well done. That's the one. And Jack, you pour in your bicarbonate of soda into the balloon. That's it, get it all in there. Brilliant, fantastic job. Right, so now we have one balloon, sorry, glow balloon. Oh man, nice happy face on. We've got our container. Let me get in there, let's see. That's all of us in there now. We have our container, empty bottle of Pepsi, or the brands are available, okay. And we're going to attach our balloon onto the bottle. Right, Jack, you're filming it again. That's it, you got it, well done. Right, are we ready? So, we've got our vinegar and we've got our balloon. And we're going to tip our balloon up and hopefully. Now, because we're amateur scientists, we haven't done any measuring as such, so this could go horribly wrong, right? Hopefully, what will happen is the carbon dioxide released will inflate the balloon. Here we go. One, <laughs> two, three. And here we go. There's our big balloon. <laughs> Inflating nicely. It's going to work. Yes. He's inflating lovely. <laughs> and if we turn the lights off, hopefully, he should be glowing. And there we go. One inflated balloon from the chemical reaction releasing carbon dioxide. Uh, thank you to Jack Doyle. Our new assistant, and our original assistant, with his goggles on upside down, Seth Doyle, at Science with the Doyles.